Hello everyone. Um, today I'm going to show you how to repair the thread, uh, damaged thread on the cylinder head. Um, have Luis, my friend here, <laughs> help me. Always messing about with my vice. Uh, he's actually helped me paint yeah. that block. Uh, you see, he just keep messing about with the vice. But let's crack on and do some work. So I have this um, thread repair kit. Uh, or early coils, whatever you guys want to call. So I'm going to use this 8 mil early coil with a tap. I think this is the right tap for it. No, this is the right tap for it. And we're going to need this as well. And I'm going to show you the threads are damaged. Uh, the thread is this one here. I think you guys may be able to see it there. It's not thread it at all. Thread is just, just gone. The other one looks a little bit dodgy as well. It looks like it's been re -tapped. You guys can see it. So we're gonna repair this thread, but uh, we don't have too much wall. The wall is a little bit, it's a little bit too small. But we try, I'm gonna try to retap it because I don't want to replace it in the head because I was being port in the, the head and um, I realized the, the thread was damaged so it's better to replace to repair now instead of fitting on the car and you have to pull the cylinder head off to redo this job properly. So let's do it. So I forgot to mention, it comes with the drill bits as well, uh, everything you need, you don't need to measure the drill bits and everything, so the drill bits is already there. So the first thing we're going to have to do is drill it, drill it out, but you really have to drill as straight as you can and go slowly all the way to the end until the drill stops. I think it's just no it happened. I think something in there. Probably the old helico oil or something. Yeah, that's far you can go. So now you grab the top. And this bit, this one goes here, so, and you pull the cylinder head forwards a bit, so I can turn this around. And you're gonna try and do the straight as you can. If you miss, the bolt will go sideways, um, and then you can't fit the bolt because the manifold. Um, the bolt goes kind of straight. You you don't have a home. To, to miss it, so. It's all the way to the end. Just come out and go back forth again, slowly. Don't put too much pressure on, on it, because if you damage this, will be over. So when you're done with the tap, you have to just blow the thread to take all the hobby out. Um, then you grab this tool and you stick this here. I think this is the right one is in the wrong place. And you just get this one in and slowly just go around until they start to go in. Actually, this went straight in. It's a bit too tight. So I think it's all in. Just pull this off. Um, then you have this kind of thing to broken them, to broken this bit inside. When you hammer it, they'll broken that bit there and it pulls the thing back. I probably need to find something to... I 
I'll just blow off it. If it doesn't come out, just blow it. Something came out. And then we need to try to see if the bolts fit, and I hope it does. Yeah, it does. Let me try with the manifold in place. Just to see. Yeah, it does work. And um, I think I'm just gonna have to, to cut a little bit of that because it did the helicoil didn't went all the way through because it's quite it's quite big. So I'll probably just cut this bit off here. And job done. Thanks for watching guys.